This guy says you can get filthy in the green with this NFT game. Like I'm talking five digits a month he's talking about. His name's Tweety Talks Crypto. Hi, I'm Rob and I test side hustles and I let you know if this is a great opportunity or something you should avoid. All right, let's go. This is an NFT game for those that are, people aren't aware of it. And basically you're breeding and racing horses. This is my test and I am jumped right in. I watched his videos. Now we're gonna try it to see how it goes. Well, so far, this is the plan. You're gonna get a couple horses and because you have two stables, you can breed them at a cheaper price, you get a discount. And actually you have to make a spreadsheet and you have to crunch your numbers. So basically it looks like this. An example of how you would calculate it. First you would figure out like, for example, this legendary Buterin horse is about 49E or 192 Canadian. And then if I were to sell, breed the horse and then sell that horse, after a royal 5% royalty, I would get $182. There's also a minimum breeding fee and the there's a discount if you breed in-house. So after all the discount and, every, and the fees, I would make a profit of $102 if I sold that new horse. And that is Canadian. So US probably around 75. And if you get two stables, you get a 55% discount and then you end up profiting $127 roughly Canadian or about $100 American. And I can say for sure is this definitely isn't for someone who's just starting out and has very little to spend. You need at least the bare bones have 600 US, 700 US, because there's food costs and there's there's small other fees you need to have enough to cover to do the game. So just a heads up if anyone were to try it. So anyways, I will post the results part two soon.